Tijan? Back, back. Chili? Out. Look. It's night round. The night of the round table. Kitty. It's princess. There's you. So give it. Touch us the dragon. Yes. <laughs> Coming to rescue. She really to likes this toy. It looks like the ones we get. Mm -hmm. No, Cha Cha, careful. Too excited. And here is Princess. Shiri, smile for the camera. Oh, Shiri, there's no way to go on top of the table. Go hide it somewhere. Cha Cha. Oh. Oh, let's see what we get for treat. Ooh, it's the stick again. Then we have winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> okay. A few moments later. Oh! Pocket trainers. He's okay. He's okay. <laughs> Ooh, bacon flavor. Training treats for dogs. Let's see the ingredients. We have vegetable, tapioca starch, bacon, natural flavor, gelatin salt, this pork, and this chickpea maple syrup. Looks okay. Kitty, that's it. Do you like this one? This one? Kitty? Kitty? My dogs are three pounds. Right, Shishi? And then there is the winner winner chicken dinner. Let's try this. Second treat, this is pocket trainer, bacon flavor. Uh oh, uh oh. Here, here. I should try. Do mm -hmm. mm. you really like this one? And these are really good because they're kind of small. In pieces like this so it is really good for the dog training we are taking class at puppy training class for a little one and all the treat we have to separate the treat into tiny bits so it's easier for training purposes and this I think we have this already deer recipe um, wait is this made out of deer I don't know I, I don't know about deers I'll check this out. Oh no, no. Honey, this is made out of deer. When I eat no reindeer. Well, I'm gonna toss this. <laughs> hey guys, so there's this crown, which is really cute. So I guess it's supposed to fit my dog, which it won't because my dog's are three pounds. 3,000 years later. There's this artwork that we missed. It's pretty cute. I think you're supposed to fill in the blank with your dog's name. And then, I don't know, maybe I'll fill in and I'll tell you guys what it says later. Three days later. Yeah. Oh, the tail of Chacha. Chacha the micro chief saw a dreadful sight. Fair Shudi <laughs> was trapped in the pooch prison. Held by the evil big booby. Cha Cha the micro chi bravely barked, I challenge thee, release fair shooty or I'll lick your nostrils. Cha Cha? Cha Cha? But the, but the villain only laughed, I'd like to see you try. And as the, as the brave pup began to lick Boo Boo's nostrils, the evil Boo Boo recoiled in shock, for nobody had ever seen such a fearsome, powerful nostril lick. No! screamed the evil Big Boo Boo. Nay, 
Prithee, I can't take it. I giveth up. You saved me, my hero, cried Fair Shooty. I shall join thee forevermore. <laughs> and so they adventured on together and enjoyed a merry day at the Peach Palace. So what about Pepperoni? <laughs> <laughs> Is he the gatekeeper? <laughs> he just came to collect some treats. <laughs> Well, this month Bark Box is kind of cute. It's castle theme. This toy is very unique. I actually never seen a dog toy. It makes this sound, and, and Prosciutto really likes it. And this type of toy she really likes too. They're really good for small chichis because they can just get them around and like swing like this. Um, it's better than the Christmas light, which were too big, and the booty <laughs> toy. So they're getting better. Um, this crown is kind of cute, but it doesn't really stay on the head, but it's kind of cute if you put, you can attach like elastic band at the end, and I think it will stay on your dogs. And the story is really cute. Uh, I recorded my husband talking about it. Um, our main character is Chacha, a new puppy, and then she's saving Shooty, the baby girl, away from our evil big old cavalier. And our, pep our other chihuahua, he's left out because there was only three people um this tree is called wing winner winner chicken dinner it's kind of cute um chicken is the first ingredient which is really good and there's potato flour cane moses <sighs> glycerin a bunch of stuff i don't want to talk i won't list i don't know what they are oh preservative rosemary extract zinc what does that even do i have no idea but at least there's chicken in it. Again, like I said last month, um, the treats are not the best quality of treat because we go to our local butcher, um, local pet supplier at a farmer's market and he gets direct treat from butcher. So if you want like uber high quality treat, I suggest you just to go to your local farmer's market. There might be a guy who sells dog treats, etc. Um, here are the pocket trainers, which we really like because um, these are small, so they're really good to train your dog. And we have three, four pound chihuahuas and their stomach fill up really quickly. So any big tree, we have to separate it. Um, these treats are good because I just split the one tiny little stick with like, all four of them. So it's all good. Overall, it's pretty good, except I don't really like this one. I don't know, it says deer. I got freaked out a little bit, maybe because I don't eat deer. Maybe, is that normal? I think one of my friends told me there was a business that was selling kangaroo meat from Australia to dogs. Um, I don't know if this is a new thing they were selling. I don't know why we can't just give them pork, deer. I mean, pork, chicken with normal meat because those are cheaper usually anyways. Uh, I don't know. I love reindeers and <laughs> I love deer, so I'm not I'm not comfortable with giving my dogs deer, especially. I mean, it's good that oh my god, there's oh yeah, deer is definitely one of the main. Oh no, we're not giving this. I love you, Bark Box, but can we not <laughs> get deer treats? Please don't show me kangaroo treats either. Okay, that's it for this month. We really like it, and they're enjoying their treat now. Bye, guys.